Hey guys, and welcome to a new series on my channel. It is all about the Euros, and all about the teams that don't get a lot of media attention. Sure, you hear a lot about your Germanys, and your Spains, and your Englands, and your Frances. But not a lot is heard about the smaller countries in the scheme of fo world football. So this series is going to be about educating you on some, a couple of facts, a couple of quick fire facts about those smaller countries, and then I'm going to show you some ultimate team play with a team made up entirely of those countries' players. Today's team is going to be Iceland. Iceland is a small island located in the North Atlantic Ocean and just to the south west of the Norwegian Sea. I've actually been there a few times on holiday and it is a really lovely place if you ever get a chance to go. I went in the middle of winter, but I've heard summer is really, really amazing. Iceland has a population of just over 300,000. Its capital city is Reykjavik. They speak Icelandic and their currency is the Icelandic krona. And currently in FIFA, they are ranked 35, which for a country of a population of only 300,000 is a very, very good. And there are some interesting facts if you want to have a read. There are some facts, there are some details about, about Iceland. So what we're going to move on to now is the FIFA. I'm going to show you my Icelandic team and here's how they line up. So this is the team. There's probably one name you do really recognise here and that is Gilfie Sigurdsson. He is, plays for Swansea. He is a regular in the Premier League so he's probably the one player you do remember. But there's a couple of other really solid players in here. Now I've got a couple of bronze left backs and right backs but they're actually very, very solid players. I've also got a couple of team of the seasons and team of the weeks. Now my rule with team of the seasons and team of the weeks is going to be this for this series. If they're under 20k I'll probably buy them but if they're not then I'm not going to bother because I I don't have a lot of money or uh, FIFA points to buy all these players so I can't really do it. So I'm going to try and keep myself to a budget. If they're under 20,000 coins I'll probably buy them if they're over 20,000, I'm probably, I'm not going to bother. So, Trash, Trashson, sorry about that name, he's a pretty solid player. He hasn't done a lot for me as far as goals and assists go at the moment. I've practiced with this team a little bit. But he finds his way down the wing and he's always, he always seems like he's in the play. And same thing with Gudmundsson. He also finds his way up and down the right wing. He hasn't done a lot as far as goals and assists, but again, he's getting involved, which is good to see. All right, so I'm gonna sh this is my team. I'm gonna sh I'm gonna play a few games with them, and I hope that we do all right. Let's get into it. So, who are we going to be up against? We're up against a four-five-one. He's got a mixture of Brazilian players and Italian, our oh, Sierra Sierra R players. Um, so, challenging game for us, we're not, we're not the best team as far as uh, quality goes, but I reckon we're a pretty good shot. Unfortunately, I couldn't find Icelandic kits, so I've just gone for my regular Australia kits that I usually play most of my games with. So let's get into it and let's see if we can score a few goals. Felipe Anderson's on the break here, can I stop him? Oh, good tackle. And good defence, good start boys, keep it up. Finn Bogson with the counter. Sigvison. Finn Bogson again looking for the person to run wide. Have a shot. Rebound. Oh, and Barzagli just clears. Here they go, Jonas and Ignatsen. Can we counter attack? Can we? Finn Bogson gets over to Sigvison. He's going to get him through. Got him through. Here we go. Finesse it, finesse it in and does. Good counter-attack by the Icelandics. Land of Ice, off to a flyer. Here we go, runs through, got put through nicely. Looked a bit awkward, but eventually got it in, which is exactly what you need. 1-0 to us. Oscar running through, he puts a through ball through. Can we get back? And we can. Good defence, let's see if we can pass it out. Good play, just a bit too far. Oh, Halverton's got it back. One, two, here we go. Now, what am I gonna do here? I'm gonna probably screw this one up. And not, and Finbergsen gets a second. Great start, hitting him on the counter really well, sitting back, passing it through, and looking for goods. This team actually plays pretty well. Crossed it across, no hope. 
Bit of a dirty goal, but when I'm playing Iceland against Brazilian and Sierra A team, I feel like I'm entitled to a few of those. Oh, he's paused the game and he is out of here. Disappointing because we were doing really well, but not a bad way to start. Two goals to Finbergsen, an assist to Halfredson and Sigberson. All right. For our second game of the episode, we are going to be sitting up against uh, uh, Liga BBVA front. And then there's a few Bundesliga players in there as well. Again, the Icelandic team did well, hit them on the counter last time. Let's see if we can do it again. Oh, they're already going forward. Kovacic for Guli, and it is 1-0. That did not take long. He just passed it straight through the middle of me and I couldn't do anything about it, which is disappointing. Let's see if we can sort ourselves out and get back. Thiago going to counter. And here they go. Fagul is running in. I've got to warn a straight line. Bring the cuts it back in. Let's see if we can bully him out. Fell. Ah, Thiago with the rebound. They just look better going forward. I can't do much more about it. They're quick. He moves pretty well. He's a lot better than the last than the last game. So I've got to got to try and switch on here. Two 0 Let's see if we can get it back. Oh, here we go. Straight through. And scores. Sigurdsson. What an. That is some quality passing. This team actually passes pretty well. They don't have high passing ranks, but. The passes usually hit nine times out of ten, which is really, really good. Across, through with the big space, and just places it in. Sigberson is he's not very quick. Can he Oh, good tackle by Rodriguez. Sigerson's got it back though. Gonna cross it in. Gudmanson. Hit. Oh, here we go. Hit that on the volley. Oh, what a hit! What a goal! Oh, what a what a volley. Hit it. Let it, took one touch, then banged it. What a goal. Probably one of the better goals I've scored in a while. Hits it, takes a touch, hits it, and what a hit. Son. 2-2. Two, two. We're back in this. Here they go. They're on the counter. They're countering really well, this team. They look threatening. Kovacic. Out to Faguli. Doing stuff I can't deal with. Because I def poor defend poorly and Fagulli gets in. My defending is awful, guys. I'll be honest. I can't defend. Especially if they start skilling, I even get in more, more trouble. Half time. Uh, looking at the... He's had a lot more of the... A lot more shots and a lot more shots on target. But I'm only 3-2 two, two down, so I'm not without a chance here. He looks dangerous on the break. I just have to sort of tighten up my defending because it's not the best. And I don't really have the best defenders, so it's going to be tough. But I reckon we're in with a chance. Still got it. He's going to go in and he's going to score. Faguli. That's the game. Really disappointing. After that first half, I was like, we're probably still in this. And we got absolutely annihilated. Goals to Sigperson and Halfredson. Goal assist to Halfredson. So we had a really good game. Last game, and let's see how we're going. This is probably a bit more of a manageable game. A lot of bronze through the mid. There's a bit of chemistry between them. To Stegen in goal, is that um, Jekko up front? And I don't know who that other striker is. But this game is much more winnable. So let's see if we can get our second win with the Icelandic team and finish on strong. Trashtason. And cut off by Jones. Here we go. Down. Gudmundsen, he's going to get on the loose ball. But yeah, it's, I should never skill. Here we go. Cut off. I'm going to dirty it up. Goal. Trasherson, he needed a goal. We'll give it to him. Probably a bit, bit dirty there, but what are you going to do? Good cut off. Good play. Cuts it across. Puts it in. 1-0. Gudmundsen's going. He's charged him. Govinson's coming back. Oh, he's done him. Oh, and Sigurdsson, two goals early on here. 
which is good news. Good assist, good cut in. He tried to slide too early, took advantage and kicked a goal. Look at that, good turn. I look like he kicked through the defender, but you'll take them when you can get them. Paused it, 10 minutes in, 2 nil down. I can probably see what's happening and he's gone. But Sigmundsson and Trashton get a goal each. Assist to Fingudson and Gudmason, and what another good win. So that's my Icelandic team. I hope you enjoyed watching this little, uh, this video. What I'm going to do is, when I play the rest of the teams, I'm going to put it together a bit of a table to see who was the best performing team, like in the Euros, and who was the worst performing team. Who would go through the next round, and who would go back to their country. A disgrace. Well, there you have it. The Icelandic team, two wins, one loss, not looking too bad. Uh, like this video and subscribe to follow the rest of my European, uh, my Euro 2016 Ultimate Team coverage. My next team should be up in the next couple of days and it is going to be Hungary. So if you're looking forward to that, please do let me know in the comments below. Also let me know if there's another team you would like me to do a squad on. Remember, I don't want to do teams that are big football powerhouses. I want to focus on teams that don't get as much notice or recognition. Thank you for watching, guys, and I'll see you later.